Below thousands of meters of ice in Antarctica lie hundreds of meltwater lakes where the Antarctic ice sheet meets the continent's bedrock. Until pretty recently, we thought that these lakes sat quietly, isolated in pockets under the ice. But in 2007, laser measurements of the ice surface from NASA's IceSat satellite were used to infer what was happening far below, and a much more interesting picture was revealed. By watching local areas of the surface of the massive ice sheet rise and fall due to fluctuations in the lake water levels below, we learned that vast hydrologic systems like rivers connect many of these lakes and that some actively fill and drain all the time. Thanks to the more advanced laser technology on NASA's ISAT-2 satellite, in a region very near a pair of larger lakes measured in 2007, two more of these lakes have just been found. A new study shows that they are currently experiencing a draining period. The finding also gives us the most detailed picture yet of how the boundaries of lakes can change over time. Areas seen here in blue show that the surface of the ice is getting lower, which indicates that the lakes below are draining. Understanding how much water is flowing under the ice sheet and how quickly it can drain to the sea helps give us a better picture of not only how quickly the Antarctic ice sheet will change due to a warming climate, but also how Antarctic melt will affect both global ocean currents and sea level rise.